Hey, you crazy cats and kittens out there. How you guys doing today? That's great. Today, as promised, I'm going to read you another Pete the Cat story. Remember yesterday we had this awesome book that had three books in one? Three. Count them. One, two, three. Three books in one. So, um, I want to know who writes the words. The author. Who draws the pictures? The illustrator. Um, what part of the book is this? Your spine, where's yours? Very good. And what does it do? It holds us together. The author of this book is James Dean. James Dean was also an actor and a really cool cat himself. So, Pete the Cat and his surprise teacher. Let's find out who the surprise teacher is. Pete is ready for school. Where is mom? Pete asks. You guys know what this is? It's a school bus. A lot of you are going to get to possibly ride the school bus next year to go to kindergarten. Yay! She has a surprise for you, says Pete's dad. Pete goes to school and his mom is there. <gasps> what a surprise! Hey class! I'm Mrs. Cat, said Pete's mom, and I am the substitute teacher. I will need your help today, said Pete's mom. What do we do first? Art, said Pete. Yeah, says the class. I guess they really like art. That's my favorite, and science. The class lines up. And Pete's mom leads the line. Is this art? asked Pete's mom. There's a sign that says what's inside that room. Does anybody know what that says? Let's find out. Well, it's not art. Boing, boing. This is gym. Stay in place, says the gym teacher. What kind of ball is that, boys and girls? A basketball. The class plays. Jim is more fun with kids, said Pete. Jim is over. Pete's mom takes the class to art. But look, the sign outside the door says music. La 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 la. This is not art. This is music. Stay and sing, says the music teacher. The class sings, and we are louder with more kids, says Pete. Rumble. Oh, Pete is hungry, and it is time for lunch. Do you think he's going to make one of them ginormous fish sandwiches like he did yesterday? Well, let's find out. Oh, this is not the lunch room. This is, what is this called, guys? The playground. Let's have a picnic, says Pete. That's a great idea. Boys and girls, get yourself a blanket and have your lunch outside and have a picnic today. Maybe not today, it's cloudy. Today is, or excuse me, now is time for art, says Pete's mom, and everybody cheers. Yay! Pete leads them to the art class. Is this art? asked Pete's mom. What's that sign say? Art. Very good. It is. And lots of kids are making art. Oh no, said the art teacher. It's too late to join us. The day is almost over. And look, Pete looks so sad. What color paint is that? Blue. Good job. The class goes to their classroom. I know, said Pete. Let's make art here, he says. Okay, said Pete's mom. And he gets out some crayons and some paper. Pete calls a huddle. That's another word where everybody gets together and they, they talk in secret. Whisper, whisper. The class plans a surprise. 
Pete draws, Callie makes paper cats, and everybody helps. What's another word when everybody's helping one another? Teamwork. That's right. The sign says, thank you, Mrs. Cat. Surprise, Pete says. The class made art for Pete's mom. Thank you, Mrs. Cat, says the class. We had a great day with you. Sometimes a different day is an awesome day. Boys and girls, that is our story for today. And um, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, so just because we're at home doesn't mean we can't still have class. Hopefully you're watching our videos. If you want to make art, grab yourself some markers, crayons, pens, pencils, some scissors. Just be careful. Remember, thumb on top, fingers on the bottom, and keep your other hand out of the way. Um, you can also um, do some fun science experiments. You can get some cornstarch and water and make oobliques. You can um, do baking soda and vinegar and watch an eruption. Um, and also take time to have a picnic. Have your lunch outside. Enjoy your day. Love you. Bye.